I'm back in the gloriously warm polytunnel now. It's currently recording 27 degrees in here and I am squinting. It really is like a summer tropical paradise in here. It's lovely. Anyway, the final job today is to join Will from the Flying Gardener's Garlic Challenge. Um, and his challenge is to grow or plant and see how we get on with growing the small cloves that you usually choose to discard from growing ones like this and in comparison this would be more of an oh dropped it this would be a normal size clove and this is the the other size and Will's challenge anyway is for us to take these smaller cloves and to plant them and see what happens next year so I have this four here and then I have another two that are a little bit bigger but still I still didn't choose to grow them in my batch so I'm not going to plant these in one of the normal vegetable beds I don't want to give over any more space to garlic really so what I'm going to do is put these like um, Will did amongst the fruit um, potentially between the strawberries I do have space next to the gooseberries but I might buy more soft fruit next year so on that basis I think around the strawberries and just see what happens and I'll be able to compare how these do crop wise against the bigger cloves um, when it's time to harvest so let's go and get these planted this certainly seems as good a spot as any so I'll put them a bit further back I'm going to not give these an unfair advantage by not giving them any space between them but probably not going to be as um, particular about how they're planted compared to how I was with the main batch. I won't walk in your way, I'll walk around this side. I mean this one here is particularly tiny. And in the interest of fairness, I am going to plant two regular sized cloves here, just here on this side, so that these have come from the same plant, so I can just sort of compare what happens in terms of how they all crop. That's that sorted. If anyone else wants to join Will's challenge you can find him at the Flying Gardener um, and we'll see how we get on. Good luck! 